Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Antelope Valley Fair 2023, as we have so much fun always bringing it to you. With Low Budget TV, I'm Jeffrey Best, alongside Tommy Mason, and we have a whole bunch of motorsports to get through. It is tradition here at the Antelope Valley Fair and its motorsports events. Low Budget TV bringing you the action. It's a windy Beautiful night here at the Antelope Valley Fairgrounds. Tonight, we are featuring autocross racing. You saw a little bit of the clips. These cars, compacts, running on an oval track with a jump and some bumps. Let's take a look at where we are at the Antelope Valley Fair and Event Center, right on the outskirts of town and the big fair going on. But that dirt pit in the center is where all the action is gonna be Looking forward to this event each and every year. And let's get going with heat number one for the AV Fair Autocross. This is an event that uh, we've been coming to for many, many years and always love making it out as Autocross heat number one. Autocross is a bit of a new addition to this whole fun. And here's our first heat lineup. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun to see these compact cars work on an oval track with some bumps and a tabletop jump right at the start finish line. Some of these drivers uh, have a lot of racing experience and some are running for their very first time. Well, the autocross events are always fun. Can get a bit goofy. The green flag is out and we are racing. Look at these things. It's our, I'm already smiling and laughing already. <laughs> there are a little bit of humps in the corners and on some of the straightaways, but here we are coming up to the tabletop. Now there, there was rumor back in the day of them potentially putting in a dirt track here and yeah. I'm, I'm glad to see they did it. They did, they finally did. Now they've got to work on the, the track prep. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> That's part of the jumps and bumps are part of it. The sixth one of Hall, Houghton, Dalton Houghton making a run to the lead. And Dalton, now what? besides racing in this front wheel drive class, it's an IMCA modified race. I was going to say, now why do I feel like he's got some dirt track experience? He got some air. He did. And, and that's kind of one of the things here with this tabletop jump, Jeffrey, is a lot of the competitors want to hit it because it looks fun, but also they don't want to tear up their car doing so. Uh, LaVita Elliott losing a couple of positions down the back straightaway. And we got lap traffic already. Oh, yeah, we do. And you got two lanes to work with. <laughs> Howden likes that jump. Howden is taking the jump, but what he doesn't know is coming up behind him is a 55. That is driver Patrick Gotti in that uh, <laughs> Ivan Stewart throwback paint scheme. They're laughing Rivera in the 4M. Laughing. I'm laughing. Everyone's laughing. You know what I'm laughing at? And then the top three are all together, but there's lap traffic I'm sorry. down the back straightaway. Rivera ran out of gas for a few seconds. Here's some side-by-side -side action coming to the tabletop. Pick your lane. Pick your right. 06, Jennifer oh, DePue. Oh, huge air from the 06 of DePue. How's that car still running? I'm going to get the... Gonna get caught up, but you mentioned the battle for the lead as the 18's gonna go down a lap. Levita Elliott as the 55 is on the charge. Patrick Gotti is coming. You know, there was a time in, <laughs> in these cars' lives where people were making payments on them. Now look what they're doing with them. <laughs> I, just oh. hope, I hope the groceries are still in the trunk <laughs> yeah. of that one. Houghton is leading, but he's got Gotti closing in. Whoa. Now, if we can get a close-up on that 61 as a battle for the lead. Oh, my gosh. Look at the left side as we have a great battle for the lead. That's an IMCA modified door panel that they put on the side. <laughs> we got live traffic. It's Rivera that they're having to work by. The IMCA door is not helping out right now. Levine oh. Elliott. But now the 55 is going to get high-centered. Still side-by-side side on a turn number four. See, and see, Howden's so used to that tabletop at yeah. this point. Is that a target on the bumper? I think it is. And Gotti tried to use that that as a target when he took the lead initially. Now Gotti's losing time. Oh my gosh, the air shots have just been hilarious. Yeah. Like I, I'm glad to see everyone actually making an effort to go over mm -hmm. this tabletop. Look at the speed that that 55 can carry going into the corner, but it looks like that same speed is also with a detriment when he gets stuck in the outer part of the track. The 169, that's Ken Lucasona, is oh. going to go down a lap. He's taking the, the banking. <laughs> and the 55 <laughs> stuck on the inner berm. Oh, no. That thing is steaming up, too. That was your second place runner. 
Patrick Gotti is completely high centered. And oh. <laughs> Angela. Where are you going, 19? That's Trosh. And the 19, and now the 18. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> Gonna create an issue Des- at the tabletop. Decisions have to be made. Dalton Houghton's gonna just jump over everybody right now. The white flag is waving. <laughs> and where's he gonna go? <laughs> he makes it through. Gets a bumper. The 06, uh, Jennifer DePew. It's like, I got somewhere to be right now. But how is that car slowing down? It is. Here's he- Lucas Onas. This car's not slowing down. No, Maybe it, it should. I, he's sparking on dirt. How is that even possible? <laughs> The checkered flag is waving, and congrats, <laughs> oh, Dalton Houghton. I'm having too much fun already. This was just the first yeah, heat. Yeah, this is the very first heat. Oh, my. Oh, my goodness. So there's the 169 <laughs> of the Lancaster Blaster, Ken Lucas Onis. Tony's fire. I, I think that's what's about to happen. Yeah. Oh, man. These are beautiful vehicles. They are. So mm. LaVita Elliott crossing the line. Yep. The 06, he went... Big air. Oh, we're, we're wrecking people on the back straight away. Right and now. now we're wrecking the cars. <laughs> Why is the thing smoking up? Now, at the very end. So, Levita Chase Elliott. Yeah. There's Gotti in the 55, who was up into the lead at one point in this race, but now up, up on, the, on the burn. Oh, yeah. See, I didn't mean to take that away from you. No, you, you earned it. But you're it, earned. it's where you were going, though. All right. We got to do this again. Oh, yeah. It is. Heat number two for the AV Fair Auto Cross. I, I'd love to see if this one's going to... Oh, my God. We got what? a what? Scion <laughs> Toaster out there on the track. E2 lineup Storm in the 02. Chris, Christiana Lucazonas in the 65 is our brave little toaster. Oh. Joe Shermer in the 647F. Clint Hines, 302. DJ Depew, Robert Kleisner, and Tony Gandolo take the green. And the Hudson Honda, or whatever that is, takes off. <laughs> We're green. All right. So, again, that tabletop, while it's fun, can also damage your car. Oh, no. Oh, here we go. The brave little toaster is going to be the first one to do it. Cristiano Lucasonis. Now, that last name is synonymous with the AV Fair. And I believe this is our first time seeing Christiana running. And we got a battle up front. Yes, we do. And, of course, it's the 51 chasing the 52, as numerically would have it. Kleisner in the 52. DJ Depew in the 51. That 52 is fast, just sitting still because of that spoiler on the rear. Now, a little bit of the draft is coming into play here. And I think it's a lot to do with the 52 of Kleisner staying behind the Hornet because... That wing could pose a drag. Now, if you're driving the 51, if you're DJ, do you take him over the tabletop? Do you throw a, a, maybe a, a wrench block. in his plans? Yeah, maybe throw a block. There is a giant tractor tire at the front of that tabletop, so you better make your decision quick. You can't come up with anything last minute, or else you're going to smack that tire. They're closing in on Tony Gandola, the first car to go one lap down here. Still on the lead lap, but Gandola's mm-hmm. going to have to fight for his life. Tony started at the near rear of the field, outside of row number three. Also closing in on the 302 of Clint Hines. All right. <laughs> Nobody wants to go over the table. Here we go. Table topic. Going around lap Triva. Could that play out? Maybe. More. Maybe not. I'm going to say more so oh, in the dirt. Oh, uh, yeah. In that, in that berm. So the halfway flag. Cross flag is in the air for your leaders. They're closing in on Christiana. And the 65. <laughs> now, <laughs> that holds up. DJ DePew. That thing looks like it has a high center of gravity. All right, battle it, for the lead. It's got a head on the roof. The bump and run. Oh, here we go. Move to the outside for the 52. Oh, and contact. Contact, and it sends a 52 sideways in the air. Flat tire, white flag. Who's going to win Heat 2? Oh, the 52, I think, is, <laughs> is now looking for the slam yeah. slam bump. But the fabulous Hudson Hornet. Man. Turning left to go left here at the <laughs> Antelope Valley Fair. Chuck and flag waves for DJ Depew. 
Look at it. Got the eyes on the windshield and everything. Well, the fun is, folks, that uh, we're going to double the amount of cars on the track. Oh, price yeah. When it's main event time. The trunk is flying open on the 302. And uh, we got some takers going over the. Look at the skeleton car. Losing. Why well, that contact tail. after the checkers? Wait a minute. Is this rivalry? I think so. <laughs> All right, if that was the rivalry, it's going to carry over into the main event for the Antelope Valley Fair Autocross. I'm ready. You see the cars making their way on to the staging lanes. We got a lineup here ready. We got a jump cam. We're going to have some onboards. Dalton Houghton's going to lead this field alongside DJ Depew. Angela Tro Angelo Tros in the number 19, Robert Kleisner in the 52, Zero 02, Samantha Storm in the 64 7F of Joe Shermer. And you see the rest of the field. You do not want to start too far deep in this field, as we saw that lap traffic comes into play quickly for these leaders, but the field is set and ready for 500 laps of porta potty racing. Okay, maybe they're off in the distance. I don't know how many laps this is, but I had a lot of fun in the heat. <laughs> Green flag is out. And we got on boards now. So now you know it's serious. We're going to get the POV perspective. All right. Houghton's going to throw it in. Now, remember, there. oh, I was going to say there was some rivalry between the 51 and 52 to end off that first heat. Who's going to go over the jump? Sometimes you got it. When the road is blocked, you got to take the lane. So Kleisner was the first one to do it, but Kleisner's falling back. Losing yeah. a lot of track position. And up front, we are side by side. Oh. Houghton and DePew. Looks like Houghton with the right front flat. Oh, already. 499 laps to go. That's going to be a long race. But the good thing about this autocross is you can stay running with a flat tire. You're going to stay Trosh. leading. Trosh trying to find a way around in the 19 lap traffic. Here's Patrick Dottie. And Trosh goes board. too wide. Yeah, you can get yourself hung up on these berms and come to an instant stop as Patrick showed in the heat. <laughs> Here comes Patrick. Hit that jump. Oh, well, yeah, you got to be careful. Sometimes, well, sometimes you got to be careful. Others, maybe not so much. Oh, we're turning them in the corners. Battle for the lead side by side, and it's going to go to the 51. Gotti is going to slam it out. This is the battle for second. <laughs> Gotti is uh, having the run from God right now. Oh, we got one stuck on the berm. We got a tabletop shot. <laughs> is that Shermer? 647F going airborne at the tabletop. Heavy lap traffic for your leaders. Oh, some contact oh. over the jump. That was decision making gone wrong. Cristiano Lucasonas meeting the 52 at the jump. <laughs> Man, that 52 has been busy. We're going the wrong way. And we're still duking it out up front. Look at the top five under a blanket. So this is this is the 55's opportunity. Remember, Patrick Gotti was high centered. Oh! <laughs> and a big slam for the lead. Oh my god. And that's the 621 of Houghton. That's Jeff Houghton making his way. <laughs> these, up into the second spot now. These leaders are going to be closing in on a massive group of lap traffic momentarily. As Clint Hines were riding along with, just <laughs> sitting there. I don't know if they're stuck or if they're pissed off. I'm beginning to think they're pissed. Oh, but there's a car stopped in the way. Oh, no. That's the 52 of Kleisner. Oh, 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 oh. coming through. That's Here's your leader. leader, Patrick Gotti. Now meeting up with that traffic jam and meeting up with the 06. Now Gotti just had contact, and that's going to allow the 621 to come through. This is the battle for the lead. So there's Jeff Houghton chasing down Gotti in the 55. There's Ooh. bumper that was big contact. Hit. The 19 is relentless. That's Mario Rivera getting turned by Troche. The 169, I think, is having right front problems. <laughs> Oh. oh, and soon to be left rear problems. Lucasonas there trying to hold off the lead pack. <laughs> Here's Christiana Lucasonas. <laughs> the brave big toaster. The brave toaster out there. <laughs> She's wheeling it right now. And uh. a hip check. <laughs> a hip check oh. from your leader. So Gotti slamming Oh, but there's contact oh. for the lead. Jeff Houghton 
shoving the 55 of Gotti. Here's a replay. So that was slamming into the 69 of Gandola, and then, then this happened. Yeah. Jeff found an opportunity to move the 55 out of his way. And another view of it. Jeff just said, nope, you're not coming across my bumper. But we've seen Gotti not yeah. afraid to throw it into the corners. What does this mean for the battle for the lead coming from this point? Can Gotti catch back up to Houghton as we take one last look at it? Here we're riding along with Clint Hines. Where are you going? Oh, but he's going to go into the infield. So here's the difference. You see, the oh, this is about two. to be bad. This <laughs> is about to be bad. Traffic jam. We got stuck on the berm now. Let's get off of there. <laughs> this is not going to work. You can't do this. There's not enough room. Oh no, we're stuck in the. We're stuck at the jump. <laughs> the only lane left to go is the tabletop. <laughs> they have piled up five or six cars deep. Oh, we're, they're throwing the red. They're just telling everyone to stop. They're still making contact there. <laughs> yeah. So that's so, your lead battle. Right <laughs> it's your lead battle. Wow. Battling it out through the red. Oh. Man, I got tears in my eyes. I'm laughing. Here is a hard. replay of all the <laughs> angles we have of it. And it looks like everybody just stacked up there. Cristiano Lucazonas, boom, into the back. <laughs> That's Ken Lucazonas, who, who was the first one to get turned. <laughs> they all just stack up. And I told you that track tire could be a dreadful one. Uh, oh, I mean, it's bigger than half the cars running in this race. Look at them all piled up. Oh, that's that's too good. All right, looks like we're getting ready to resume. The green flag is unfurled, but not technically waving. And now, now it it's is. waving as the autocross main event is back green. Green flag is out. And what is the battle for the lead going to look like now? Are we going to do it again? We I think so. <laughs> just about. So, Dalton Houghton back on track. Looks like they changed the tire on it. There's Jeff out now, the leader. But Gotti is way ahead of him. Did, did Gotti lose that much time or did he drive I, past them? I think Gotti went into the pits for a change. Oh. Is Dalton out and going for a ride here? That's the 06 that he's going to share a little paint with. Dalton Houghton nearby. Here at the Antelope Valley Fair had a front row seat, but unfortunately that right front tire gave out early in this race. Uh -oh. And uh -oh. the 4M oh, no. stuck on the berm. Rivera with another interesting moment. Now we're stacking up here as the 51 is going to get moved out of the way by Dalton Houghton. <laughs> Bump draft, turn, the 0-2. You can see the right front broke right in front of the traffic. <laughs> yeah, what a, what a bad spot to be in on the other side of the jump. Chris. <laughs> so it's, it's, uh, Look at this. Where do you go? Uh, yeah, that's not, the, that's not the best spot to be, is it? White flag is going to come out for the 621. This is Jeff Houghton. Either that or the officials gave up. <laughs> and they're waving the white flag. What does it say? Roll me? I can't even read what it says on the back of Well, the I can tell you that whatever it says... It's looking good, especially when he parks it in victory lane. The 621, Jeff Houghton, checkered flag at the Antelope Valley Fair. Autocross, oh. main event in Christiana. Looking at one more opportunity to send that 65. That was a lot of fun, Jeff. Oh my gosh. This, again, this was a recent addition to these motorsports events at the Antelope Valley Fair. I love them. That the autocross is it's a goofy event, but it's the kind of event that a lot of these cars are able to come back next year. Maybe not the zero two. Maybe not. Well we're gonna send it to Victory Lane to hear from Jeff Houghton, your winner here at the Antelope Valley Fair. Well, 
called Jeffrey. What it in sight? What it? I don't, I'm, I'm lost for words, Jeffrey. God. That was a hell of an auto demo cross race. I, I believe the word you were looking for was shit show. And Phibius. <laughs> <laughs> On dirt and in the air. <laughs> that was some good stuff. The Antelope Valley Fair always bringing the entertainment. And uh, yeah, this was just the first of lots of motorsports coverage from 2023 that you can check out on low budget tv I want to thank everyone for joining us all the competitors for putting on a show that was fun good stuff here from the antelope valley fair happy to be bringing you the coverage we got more coverage coming up here from the antelope valley fairgrounds don't miss it <laughs>